I'm Dr. Kyra Bobinet. I'm the author of Unstoppable Brain. And what I do is I translate neuroscience into behavior change for everyday life. It's in the zeitgeist that people have really difficult with difficulty with their attention span. They feel brain foggy. They feel, you know, less concentration for what they want to do. They can't do deep work. And then there's also this epidemic of loneliness layer that has been kind of sitting on the heels of this because we can't really focus on anything, including relationship building. There's another area of our brains, which nobody knows about yet, that is the master control of our behavior. So this is the part that says you will or you won't, you know, I can or I can't. And it's called the habenula. It is at the heart of all of this. It's it's the heart of when you know you should be doing something and you do this other thing instead, like doom scrolling. And what happens with the habenula is that when it gets activated, it then kills our motivation to do good things. It kills our motivation to try. And so that stuckness that people feel with brain rot is really the, the habenula going on because it's been shown to go on when you doom scroll. It's been shown to be triggered by those kinds of activities. And so when we're online too much and we don't find what we need or we feel dissatisfied, even in a tiny way, if this activates, then we're not going to feel motivated to do anything for ourselves for the rest of the day. If you are addicted to social media or online behavior is getting you know addictive for you, this part of your brain is going to make it very, very painful to stop. Humans are very resilient. Once we know the truth about our bodies, then we can do something about it. And the thing that really tugs at my heart is that because nobody knows about this, then they blame themselves and they, far, they fall further down into feeling badly. And that's unnecessary. I'm hoping that by understanding our bodies, understanding that we have this little tripwire for our motivation, our brain, that we can live in a more empowered and intentional way.